Well, good morning. It is officially my first day of Christmas break and our um, house has been sick and not sleeping well. Last night, actually the last two weeks, Nevaeh has been really off her schedule. Last night, she went to bed about her normal time, like six o'clock or so, and then woke up at about 11.30 and didn't fall asleep till about two. So just kind of off, she's teething again. She's got two little teeth coming through, so so fun. But it's kind of a pain, as many of you know, with teething, how hard it is on the little one. And then she had, last weekend, a fever and was throwing up. And now Blaze, this last weekend, is was sick, and he still is. So I think he's going to go in. But it's a late start to the morning, too. I'm making breakfast at 8.20. Normally, we're up by 6 o'clock for sure, feeding Nevea. But like I said, it was off, so I just slept and let Nevea sleep and wake us up when she woke up. So I'm making some eggs and some mushrooms and spinach like I normally do for breakfast. And then I plan to make a few Christmas goodies, maybe some homemade eggnog. But the day brings and hopefully Blaze gets over his fever too because it's two days till Christmas when I'm filming this. It's the 23rd. So hopefully he is capable to go with us to some holiday things because he didn't get to go over the weekend to some things we had to do. Anyways, okay, quit talking and take you along with me today. Gotta use my Christmas mug. So now I have this mass of cleanup to do from breakfast. And um, yeah, it just makes things take a little longer because it's already 9.30. And what time did I say I started making breakfast? 8.20. Normally I'm done with everything by nine o'clock or within 40, mo 40 minutes of the time I started. So that's okay. I'm home. Um, I'm not working for the next two weeks and I'm so excited for this break. But let's get cleaning because I need to do that because who knows when she's gonna wake up from her nap. Oh, and I'm watching a Hallmark movie, of course. Have to watch a Hallmark Christmas movie.
I feel better. I got the kitchen more tidied and clean, dishes done. Um, having my one and a half cup of coffee now. After my first, like fourth cup of black coffee, I add some milk and stevia into it. So good. I don't know why I do that, but I've done that now for like a year. Um, I've got some laundry going. You always have to have laundry going. I got these new dryer balls from Amazon. I've actually used them before. This is what they look like. I'm gonna just put a couple drops of purification on them because we've all been sick, like I said, and I just think it will hopefully help with all the laundry. Um, I love these dryer balls. They're only like six bucks, and I had some for like six months and then rotate them out. So, um, yeah, I only put like four of the balls in there at a time, sometimes three. They have worked really well, help with less static, and you can put essential oil drops on them. So I'm gonna put some laundry in the dryer, probably change out our sheets since Blaze has been sick, and get all that fresh laundry going. It smells so good. I'm excited to use these in my laundry. So we'll get that going here. Sorry, lighting changes. Gotta do some laundry. Um, oh, our washing machine has been having some problems where it won't get all the water out and it just had that problem so i'm gonna have to spin it again this is so frustrating sometimes i think if i overfill it that's what happens oh it's running and the door is open it's running and the door is open how is that working honey it's soaking wet and it's running and the door is open I gotta spin it again. Ugh. It is so wet. I feel it. You can see that. Uh, oh my goodness. You want to freeze that? Oh, yeah, okay. Check something. It might be over full. No, maybe. Did something get stuck? Oh, that's a lot of water in the bottom. Oh, yeah. It's not wanting to spin. That's the issue. You think because it's too full? Possibly. I filled it that full before. Oh, it's so much water. Oh. Try it again. Okay, I'll just do the rinse and spin. All right, well, the washing machine hopefully spins out. Hopefully. I'm going to make Blaze and myself a flu bomb. We've been taking this. I took this over Thanksgiving when I was sick for like a week and a half, and I got better. I didn't have to go in, nothing. So it was perfect. It's um, frankincense, oregano. Lemon Thieves. This is Young Living brand. Um, what else? Uh, da, da, da. Let me think here. I gotta look. I say Lemon Thieves. Oh, Melaleuca or tea tree oil. And you mix it all on a pill. Certain amounts of ratio you have to put in. And take it in your veggie capsule. And I think it has helped me immensely when I was sick. And so I've been giving it to blaze to hopefully help him so i'm gonna mix that up and give it to him um i really have gotten into essential oils quite a bit more i'm diffusing thieves and like the flu bomb throughout the house too so hopefully we don't get a sick it cleans out the air um yeah so i'm gonna make him one and myself one all right let's see if the washing machine's better well still soaking wet on some of it but i think it did spin it out i might just have to separate it and put some in the dryer now and some later. I've had to do that a few times. This is where a clothesline would be nice, even in the middle of the winter. And guess who I hear? My little one's waking up from her nap. She had a good um, hour and 20 minute nap. Yay, that's always nice when they have a solid morning nap and solid afternoon nap. So I'll probably go get her up and let her play for a little bit. <laughs> My bouncing baby. She loves this bouncer. Thank you, sister. Yeah, you love it, don't you? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Hi, honey. Hi, Nevaeh. Oh, oh, are you trying to show off? Are you showing off? <laughs> Cutie. Well, it's been a little while since I've talked to you last. It is 1.15 and Nevea is down for her afternoon nap. She is teething still so much that it's hard to put her down because she just cries. But I got the Oreo balls made and 
um, another little laundry in. It did ring out once I did that second spin, which was good. Um, I got some spaghetti squash baked because I'm going to do something with spaghetti squash tonight for supper. Not sure yet. Blaze went to go to an acute care because he's still running a fever four days in a row. Hopefully it's nothing too serious or severe. Um, so I'll show you my Oreo balls and nothing extravagant. So there they are. I used, I normally use white on top. They don't look the greatest, but hey, they're for Blaze and I, and they'll taste great no matter what they look like. And I've been watching lots of, well, these aren't Hallmark. These are Lifetime movies <laughs> for Christmas, so that's fun. Oh, still working on some coffee over there. Got my second round of dishes done. Here's my spaghetti squash. Gotta de-seed it. It's pretty little, so it'll be enough just for one meal tonight. Um, oh, I got these cute towels from our neighbors and this oven mitt and a few other things, but um, no, those are fun to use for the winter season. All right, for lunch, I am eating a salad with some ham left over from Christmas on Saturday. We put some carrots on it, a little cottage cheese, and yes, that is cranberry sauce slash salad. It is just two bags of cranberries, two oranges, and some sugar. That's it. It is so good, and um, I think people really liked it. It's got, you know, that tart and sweet, so I just used it kind of as my dressing, a little bit healthier. So that's my quick lunch at 1.30, and I'm going to keep working on um, cleaning and sanitizing a little bit of the house. We are gonna go for an afternoon walk. It is probably like 40 degrees out. So, get my coat on. I'll show you Miss Nevea in her car seat. <gasps> there it is. We have matching hats. It has a cute little ball on the top. There she is. Hi, honey. <laughs> so we're gonna go for a little walk and then bath time. I gotta say, it is so refreshing to go for a walk in winter time. And you like your matching hats? <laughs> I got them from Groupon. Um, it was a fun little Christmas gift for Nevea and I. First child, I know, probably silly to get matching hats, but I think they're so adorable. She sees Maggie. Do you see Maggie, honey? <laughs> she likes making that grunting noise, so. Fun walk to be outside, just so refreshing and good to get out of the house. So now it's a little playtime, bath time, supper time, bedtime. That's her routine for the rest of the night and hopefully she goes down okay. May have to give her some more Tylenol if she's teething, but we'll see and I just pray that she goes down okay. Right, honey? Yeah, you got a little dirty face, don't you? Yes, you do. Oh, it's a cold face, a little chilly face. Yes, it is. <laughs> Nevaeh is down for the night. It took some coaxing with her being a little fussy. I uh, gave her some Tylenol, of course, because she's having some pain. So I start putting her down at, what, well, it was about 5.30 and it's 6.30. So with her teething, it takes a long time. We used to be able to just lay her down and she'd fall right asleep. So that's hard on me. Well, and Blaze just not having her normal. Um, I'm working on supper. It is just a spaghetti squash and... I added some mushrooms to it and it has garlic in it and then I'll put Parmesan cheese in it and I had turkey bacon so I'm going to throw that in there. I kind of followed a recipe. Um, we'll probably have some leftover buns from Christmas with it and some pineapple and pretty simple. Um, Blaze is back from the doctor's. He didn't have anything, did you, honey? No. Nope. So he's healthy. <laughs> Not really healthy, but... No, they don't know any yet. Yeah, they don't know what he has. It's a cold or it could be some form of a flu that they'll be tested for. Okay. They don't know though. So, his te yeah, test was not worthwhile. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I guess not, but I'm glad he's not contagious or anything really, I don't think. So, well, maybe he is. 
I don't know. The washing machine though, I'm about ready to uh, kick it overboard. I had to wash some clothes three times because it was so soaking wet. I was about ready to just go to the laundromat. But I took some clothes out and did the rinse and spin. It doesn't have just a spin cycle, just it has rinse too. So it adds more water. The water is not getting out. But finally, after the fourth time, it worked. So I don't know. I think I need a new washing machine. We've said that for a while now, but it hadn't done it for a couple months. So now I can only got two loads of laundry done today instead of three like I needed to. But so it goes, little life problems. So we're gonna work on the supper and boys got a little heater for Nevaeh's room. That's what's on the table. And then I don't know what we're gonna do tonight. Um, maybe watch, we've been watching Downton Abbey and we watched that for like three hours last night. So maybe I'll watch more of that. I'm not sure. And I did shower. That was really refreshing too. While uh, Nevaeh was crying and Blaze was um, trying to calm her down, I was showering. Well everyone, I'm going to call it a night. It's about 8.30 and Blaze and I are going to finish our Downton Abbey episode that we're on. Fold a basket of laundry and I'm going to enjoy my Christmas gift that he gave me which is an amazing little back massager here. Boom, there it is. I'm going to enjoy that tonight too because that'll be a nice special treat. He was really thoughtful and we opened our Christmas gifts tonight for each other. Um, and then I'm going to drink some of my hot chocolate. So that'll be the night and Navea will probably wake up to eat here in a little bit anyways. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Get a, a thumbs up if you did and have a blessed and wonderful holiday season and I'll talk with you in the next video. Bye!